snack or trash? We have a snack tier list. We're going to go through all these bags of snacks and we're going to, and a box of snacks, and we're going to see what belongs in what now, huh? Let's see. We have S tier, A, B, C, D, F, and trash can. <laughs> so we're going to go animal crackers, and I'm not going to hesitate. Animal crackers, this kind right here, I recognize this, this, this label, goes to S tier. The best animal crackers brand there ever is. Or was I'm not sure if they still make this brand I'm not sure but it's forever missed because I haven't really I remember it but I just don't know if they're around anymore if they're not F for respect in the chat please combos oh dude <laughs> any any combos is good any combos is good I mean you cannot go wrong with combos there's no, there's no question there, there's no debate and then you got Chex Mix but I'm going to give Chex Mix a C yeah I know this is going to be a difficult one but Chex Mix to me I'll choose combos over Chex Mix I'm just, just, that's all I have to say I mean I'm not really a huge Chex Mix person because they put stuff in the Chex Mix that I don't like it's awful and honestly B for Bugles because Bugles is awesome an old school snack. You can still put it on your fingers. That's what you're supposed to do. And um, Bugles has... They don't over-advertise. They don't get into the rat race or all that stuff. I mean, I don't think they changed their formula in a long time. I think they're still the same as they were before, many years ago. Cheese balls. Oh, boy. Um, hmm, cheese balls. We're going to go B. It's light. It's a light snack. It's not too much. They're easy to eat. And you can't go wrong with cheese balls. I mean, come on. You have to be an absolute idiot if you do not like cheese balls. That's all I have to say. I mean, you have no life if you don't like cheese balls. You know what? I see Cheetos, and this is the normal, this is the regular flavor. Hmm, all right, you know what? Here's the thing. Watch what I do here. Watch what I do here. Cheetos belongs in C. I know. I know. Why did you do that? I did that because I... Cheese Cheetos has really changed. I don't know what it is, but they're flaming hot. Oh, dude, absolutely destroys the regular. I don't care. Flaming hot Cheetos is way above the regular cheese flavored Cheetos. I don't care what war I cause in the comments about this. This has to be done because flaming hot as i know it's fake flavoring they're all fake you can't escape it it's better than the regular runner up <laughs> i know they, they have changed a lot i don't know what it is cheese it really changed it doesn't taste the same as it used to i find knockoff cheese it's a little better and i know that's going to cause a problem Everything I choose causes a, a war in the comments about my tier list, and I don't care. Cheez-Its are still an A for me. And that's that, because I, there, there's other flavors of Cheez-Its I would put on this list, but they're not here. As you can see, there's no other Cheez-Its here. So Cheez-It has changed. I don't know what it is with their flavoring. I don't know if they changed their formula. I, it's not the same. I don't remember it. Though. It's still an A, though. Chex Mix regular, ugh, God, nah. I'll take the, I'll take the, uh, the cheese. I'll take this one over this one any day. Combos pizza, oh dude, <laughs> oh combos pizza flavor. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Step on up. That's the uh, gas station right here. You go to the gas station, Seven Eleven. Combos are everywhere. You'll never run out of a combo. 
you'll, another thing you'll see at the gas station. Cool Ranch Doritos. Uh, I'm going to put you at B. I'm going to put you at B. Come on. Move. There. Cool. You can't go wrong with Cool Ranch. You, you just can't. Um, there's no... With ranch dressing? I don't I don't really... Ranch, cool Ranch with ranch, dress, ranch dressing. I don't care. Corn nuts... Ugh. I don't really know. Trash can belongs in the trash. I I really I don't eat these. I ugh. I don't know. Rainbow brownies from Little Debbie. Why rainbow sprinkled the brownies? I have no idea. When I'm gonna put them, I'm gonna put them a D because honestly, I'm not the brownies. They're not real brownies. Alright, they're obviously not real brownies. Little Debbie's is fine. But they're brownies. Meh. Meh at best. That's all I gotta say. Sun Chips. I'm gonna give Sun Chips the B for the win here. Come on. Sun Chips is the best. Yes, um, some Sun Chips is a pain in the ass. Some, some are okay. The chips are, the chips can hurt your mouth. Hey, they can't hurt your mouth. I mean, <laughs> sun chips are, are very good. They're not healthy, even though they're labeled as healthy, but they're not. Don't get fooled. Fritos, F. I'm not really, I'm not even going there. I don't care. I just, I, nah, God. Ugh. Fruit snacks, you can't go wrong with fruit snacks, dude. Welsh's fruit snacks, B. First of all, they don't break your teeth. They're soft snack. They won't hurt your mouth when you eat, like Doritos and Sun Chips. But they're not a chip. So, there you go. They're not a chip. It's a fruit snack. It's a it's an artificial flavored gummy. And that's it. That's all I gotta say about the Welsh's fruit snacks. Funyuns? Ah, oh, shit. This is gonna be difficult. See? See? I'm gonna have to put it... Uh, definitely, they have to get... You know what? There, see, because Funyuns, they, they leave a weird texture when you eat these. And your mouth feels weird when you eat them. And it is, hold on. Okay. Oh, God, I just had to adjust something on their uh, microphone. Yeah, so, no, not in the Funyuns. Funyuns are, they're good, but they're not, you know, no, you're not that great. I'll give these barbecue a C. I'm not really a barbecue chip person either. Depends on the barbecue. And the kettle chips are very hard. The kettle chips are very hard. Sometimes they're so hard you can't bite it. Because the chip is stiff. It's like stale. You know, man, look at this. Animal Crackers is going to have a... Animal Crackers is about to have a... A running mate soon because goldfish. Oh my god, goldfish belongs in S tier. Pepperidge Farm remembers, and goldfish belongs in the S tier. I don't care. They still make it. They never change. Pepperidge Farm. I'm telling you right now, the only cracker that I like from Pepperidge Farm is the goldfish. Moving on is the. Salsa Sun Chip. I like the Salsa Sun Chip. And I'm going to put this at A. Next to the cheese. it Very good. Not spicy, but good. Sun Chips never let you down. Besides that one time they put those stupid bags that made all that noise. They were trying to go eco-friendly. That didn't last. That was a, that was a short-lived thing, right? You know? So what do you think on Sun Chips uh, Garden Salsa? I like it. It's all right. It's decent. Beef jerky. Now, Jack Link's doesn't... For the price, I should give it a D because it's expensive. But I'm going to give Jack Link's a B. Not a D, a B. Beef jerky is all right. 
some of it's too tough. It's beef, beef jerky is very tough. I'd rather have a Slim Jim. And I know that you're going to say Slim Jim's not real meat. I get it. Whatever. But there you go. Some uh, Jack Link's jerky. Do you like it? Yes, no, maybe so. All right, I'm, I'm getting tired. Barbecue, you know what? Nah, Lay's, nah. You know what? Fuck you, Lay's. Your barbecue ain't that great. Is is no. Just I don't know. If I see it, I'll buy it, but nah. Nah. God. Ah, I gotta get through this really quick. I gotta get through this a little fast. Faster. I ramble on about a fucking bag of chips. I'm gonna put sour cream and onion lays there. Lays is okay. Lays it's there. I'm not a huge fan of lays. Oots is good. I don't see oots chips on here. I don't see Oots in here at all. What the hell? I don't see Oots. U-T-Z. Huh. Well, Lay's is okay. It's not my favorite chip. But now, what's next? Tostitos? Oh, my God. Depends on the salsa. A all day. Tost Tostitos anything. I have no problem with Tostitos. Give me the habanero salsa any day with the Tostitos. Uh, Nutty Bars, I'll give it a D. I mean, I'm not really, I'm not huge on these things, man. Like, I, uh, oh, God, this is difficult for me. Oh. All right, you know what, Doritos, nacho flavor, dude, come on. This is, this is going to cause an absolute riot. <sighs> There's another thing that definitely don't taste the same anymore. But I'm going to give it a... Uh, oh, shit. Uh, oh, I'm going to have to put it there. Oh, my God. No. Oh, yeah. That's where it goes. A. Next, between the pizza and the other combos. Actually, this is what I'm going to do. There you go. That's better. That's way better. Ladies, regular. So salty. Oh, my God. So salty. I give it. I have to give it a C. It's way too salty for me. Oh my god. Oh, but I'm gonna put it here. All right, I'm gonna put it there. It's, they're very salty. It's so salty. You got there's. They have a flavor that's less salty. That's how salty they are. Pringles. Pringles. I'm gonna give the regular the regular Pringles a C because I'm not really into the whole into the regular Pringle flavor. I'm glad they still come in a tube. That's a plus. And then there's Ruffles. D. Because Ruffles, honestly, um, they're very salty as well. So I don't know what that is. I don't eat the, I don't eat nuts, number one. So that's trash can. These trash can. I don't like these either. Trash. Very hard, stale, and trash. Goldfish. Goldfish, anything goes up here for me. I don't care what anybody says in the chat. That goldfish, anything on my tier list, go up here. Seriously. <laughs> Pizza, Pringles, uh, give you a B. And I'm going to give it a B because I do like pizza-flavored chips. It depends on what, what brand. Uh, where do I put this? I'm going to put it right here. The regular Pringles are just blah to me. I just, I can't. Sour, I'm gonna, since speaking of Pringles, sour cream and onion Pringles? Mm, I'm going to go here too. You know what? <sighs> There's some Pringles flavors that aren't on here that I would go above C and B, but they're not here. Smart corn? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Encore. Encore popcorn. So I, obviously, there's nothing. Making your own popcorn from scratch is better. This, I don't care. It competes with the uh, uh, movie theater popcorn any day. I'm just saying. Rolled gold pretzels? A B. Just a B. There, I'm gonna do this. There, oh god. 
Nope, gotta keep going. Nope, oh, keep going. I'm a pretzel person. I don't care. You know what? No, no, no. I'm serious about this one. Oh, yeah. Pretzels any day. The thin ones are better. I, like, this is the thin bag. They're not too hard. We can dip them in mustard. Perfect. Party. What are they? Cheese puffs? Cheese puffs? Eh. I'm going to put it there. And I'm going to put it right. I'm going to put it right here. Cheese puffs are okay. I mean, they're, they're just basically air with cheese in it. <laughs> That's what they are. All right, raisins. F. I'm not really a huge raisin person. <laughs> I just put that right there. This, this is getting crazy now. I don't eat that either. Now we're getting to the undesirable stuff. Ritz bits, or they just call them Ritz. I'm gonna give them. I'm gonna give them. They're good. I'm gonna give them a D. Just be. You know what? Ritz are there. I buy it. They're okay. They're not my favorite. They deserve a D. And this is Ruffles. I don't know what flavor this is. I can't tell. But I'm going to do this. Because Ruffles deserves a D in general. Just for the hell of it. Because I'm not really a Ruffles person. And when I see Ruffles and I open the bag, there's no chips in it. I hate that. When you buy a bag of chips and there's no Freaking bag. There's no chips in it. It's all air. Piss me off. I don't know what this is. Kettle. By default, I'm just going to put it there because I don't know what flavor that is. I don't recognize it. But Kettle is an okay brand, and I would probably like it. I might not like it. So I put it at the Schneider's Pretzels. Schneider's Pretzels always deserves a C. They can I can do with or without a Schneider's pretzel. They're okay. They're not perfect, but they're okay. And I'm gonna move it up here. These I like these. I didn't like these. Now I like these again. I, it's a love hate thing with Doritos. Sweet chili. I want to give it a. I'm gonna give them. All the way at the end of B. They're good. I like them. There's other flavors that are better. Moving on. <laughs> the Nah, trash can. Nah. Oh, God, no. I can't. Trash can for me. Sun Chips Original. That's what it looks like, right? Uh, Sun Chips Original. You know what? I'm going to give it a, oh boy, I'm going to give the original a C. There's no flavor in the original. Like, dude, the, the, the original flavored Sun Chips, if that's what that is, it looks like it. I, there's no flavor. I, I like their flavored ones. The original just tastes like cardboard. They're good. It gets the job done, but it's not just there yet. Tostitos, anything goes to A. Like, Seriously. With salsa included, deserves an A. Without salsa, eh. Frisket, trash. Trash kit. Wheat thins. Let me do this real quick. There you go. Next to cheese, it's next to cheese. Oh, we got goldfish. Oh, we got goldfish again. Ah, <sighs> here we go. There you go. That have it. I'm not changing it. This is it. Like it. Don't like it. Let me know. Perfect tier list. I'm surprised there's that many S tiers. There's only four things on S tier. <laughs> like, the goldfish definitely deserves an S tier. You cannot knock Pepperidge Farms. And that is it for this tier list. I'm out of here. Thanks for watching. And um, stay safe out there. Bye.